word is NASA has tested its quiet supersonic jet. Once again, NASA has unveiled one of its innovations and showcased another creation that's truly amazing. NASA, which stands for the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, is, of course, a United States government agency. It operates in the fields of science and technology related to aeronautics and space. It began its operations back on October 1st, 1958. That was 67 years ago. Over the years, as you're probably aware, they've achieved some incredible milestones. Hello and welcome, everyone. Great to have you here. Right now, this powerhouse agency has built and tested a quiet supersonic jet, the X-59, powered by an engine from General Electric, and it successfully passed this initial test phase. The X-59 research aircraft, developed by NASA, is undergoing phased testing, focusing on its quiet supersonic technology and performance, and apparently, it's demonstrating impressive top-notch performance. So, if you're wondering about the application of this jet and what makes it different, I should tell you that the technology incorporated into this aircraft allows it to produce significantly less noise. When the plane takes off, it generates a much quieter sound, so it won't disturb or startle people on the ground. You see, when an aircraft exceeds the speed of sound, Mach 1, that's about 1,234 kilometers per hour or 767 miles per hour, it creates a very loud noise, commonly known as a sonic boom. This powerful boom is caused by the buildup of shock waves generated by the aircraft traveling at high speed, compressing the air around it. It results in a loud bang and sometimes vibrations strong enough to even break windows. This issue led the United States Federal Aviation Administration, the FAA, to ban civilian supersonic flights over land back in 1973. And this ultimately contributed to the cancellation of popular commercial supersonic services like the Concorde, which did startle people on the ground. The Concorde faced numerous noise complaints during its operational years, and ultimately, this legendary aircraft had its final flight in 2003. But now, NASA believes it has tackled this problem using innovative and practical technology to create a quiet supersonic jet, aiming to eliminate that startling sonic boom. Researchers believe if this technology proves successful, it could revolutionize air travel. This means intercontinental flight times could be significantly reduced. Imagine flying from New York to London in just three hours, maybe even less. The X-59 aircraft was first rolled out of its hangar in California in January 2024, and its striking appearance certainly made for a spectacular sight. This new aircraft features a sleek, elongated and very slender design, measuring about 98 feet long, 14 feet high, with a wingspan of about 30 feet which is clearly a very deliberate design. This design approach helps minimize the abrupt pressure changes that cause a loud sonic boom. According to a NASA engineer, the sound this jet makes should be more like a quiet thump, comparable to a car door closing nearby. That's about 75 decibels. Also, it's worth noting the engine is mounted on top of the fuselage, a design choice that further helps shield noise from reaching the ground. Interestingly, the X-59 doesn't have a traditional forward-facing cockpit window, a design element that also helps reduce noise. 
Instead, it's equipped with an external vision system, or XVS, which uses a combination of high-resolution cameras, sensors, and 4K displays mounted in the cockpit to give the pilot a clear view of what's ahead and around the jet. This aircraft and potentially future planes using this tech are designed to fly higher than most current commercial airliners, around 52,500 feet. For comparison, the typical cruising altitude ceiling for many airliners is around 41,000 feet, although aircraft like the Airbus A380 can reach about 43,000 feet. Okay, circling back to the main point, the testing of NASA's quiet supersonic jet, which has successfully completed its initial ground tests. The agency has achieved its first major milestone, successfully reducing the engine's loud noise during these ground operations. The manager for the X-59's propulsion system announced that they successfully completed the engine ground tests according to plan. Airflow through the engine system was smooth and stable, matching predictions from wind tunnel simulations, with no structural problems or excessive vibrations detected. Additionally, all components requiring cooling performed as expected. NASA plans for the X-59 to eventually fly at speeds around 1,500 kilometers per hour, about 930 miles per hour, and at an altitude of 16,000 meters, 52,500 feet. The agency hasn't announced a specific date for the first flight yet, as work is ongoing and more tests are required. However, estimates suggest the first flight could potentially happen sometime in 2027. Indeed, this aircraft is still experimental, but its combination of high speed and significantly reduced noise has the potential to revolutionize the aviation industry and help mitigate noise pollution issues. All right, thanks so much for watching all the way through. We'd love to hear your thoughts on this topic, so please leave a comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and give this video a like if you enjoyed it.